How's it going everyone? Today I'm bringing you two more products from the company The Better Boat. The first product is their new dock lines. And then the next product is their fender lines. So what it says about these products is they're ultra durable braided fiber, weather resistant and marine grade. It says the same thing for the fender lines. Both these products are the same type of rope, but they're specifically sized for either docking your boat or putting uh, fenders on your boat. And on the back, they actually have a key here that'll show you what size dock line you need for your boat. So our boat is a Sea Ray 220 Sun Deck. So it's up to 25 feet, because it's 23 and a half feet with a swim deck. So that's why we have three ASINs rope here. The recommended max working load is 820 pounds, and it goes up 35, 45, 55, and 70. If we don't have a 70 foot boat, that'd be quite nice, but you can have a one inch dock line there for that. And then on the back of this one, you don't really need huge uh, line for fender, so it just kind of shows you some of their other products on the back here. And I've reviewed a bunch of these products, so you guys can check them out. I'll have some links in the description. I've been very impressed with everything I've received from the company The Better Boat, especially their deck cleaner and their boat soap and vinyl clean. They have all kinds of good stuff. Be sure to check out the links in the description for any of those products. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna open up this package for the dock lines first, and I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like. First thing I'd like to say is the packaging is quite good. You got four lines here. They're all wrapped up really nice. So let's see if I can figure out how to unwrap one. Okay, so the first thing I notice is that end cap you got wax on it and then you got uh, strings braiding around it and then you got some braided line and I believe these are 15 feet long so that is plenty long for docking needs that's like what it looks like braided it's definitely stiff you got a little bit of give in it when you compress it but overall seems very good and then this is the other important piece right here this is where it makes the loop to go around your cleat or your dock if you leave them permanently on. And then down there, that looks pretty good too. So I would say quality is definitely there. I also like that they're black. They have other colors, but I wanted black because they don't get dirty. And if you're like us and you bring your boat in and out of the water all the time, then your dock lines are gonna end up in truck beds, on the ground, they end up all over the place and they tend to get dirty if they're lighter colors, and at least in my experience. So now we're gonna take a look at the fender lines. So I'm just gonna show you previously what we are using. So here's our boat fender. This is a uh, tailor-made fender, came with our boat. And then we just have some general marine grade line on here. So here's the issue with this. One, the cap, it's not great. It comes apart and it's very hard, so it can ding up the surface if it whips and hits the surface in the wind or something. Another thing is this line is white and we tend to leave, these, these get wet. And because of that, they, uh, the rope can get dirty because they tend to be in dirty compartments with wet stuff. So you can see this is just after one season of use this line is pretty dang dirty so we're going to go ahead and put the uh, new better boat line on which is black and that'll definitely help our fender line stay looking nice okay so i just remove the old line i'm going to go ahead and open up this box here something i'm very impressed by just with their fender lines you have the same level of quality for the uh, end caps and then again for the loop here. But notice too that the loop is quite a bit smaller on this one because you're not gonna be putting this through a cleat, which I think is a good thing because you're not gonna have a huge uh, loop down there on the bottom. That's uh, another good piece of uh, manufacturing there. Also, this is a pretty thin rope, which is good because if you have dock lines on and you wanna put this rope through your cleat, not all cleats are massive, so this is gonna give you space to use dock lines and fenders. So how you're gonna put this on is you're gonna take the uh, loop end like that, take your fender, put it through the loop end, take the single end, wrap it around, pull it through, and then now you have it all set up with a fender line. The other bad thing about this setup, what we had is in the uh, 
unfortunate event that you forget to take your fender off after docking or rafting up with someone, we just had a knot at the end. And if that knot is continually bouncing against the boat, there is a fairly decent chance it could come undone. That's why you see fenders floating around the lake and everything. So with this, there is no way in heck that is coming out. Okay, so here you can see I have my cleat and then I, this is the um, fender line. So if you're gonna use this, all you gotta do is take your line and wrap it how you see fit. There you go. You just take this line and pull it up in the boat. So there's your fender, your line's attached to it. That's definitely not gonna come undone. I feel pretty good about this. So the next thing here is I'm gonna show you the um, dock line. So here's the line with the loop end. So you're gonna take the loop end, put it through, pull it around. Now you're in. You can see, if I give that a yank, you can actually see the boat's moving a little bit. This is definitely very strong and I have no fears about this coming out at all. I kind of like that it's a thinner line too. With that line on there, I can go ahead and take my fender and put that on there too. Just like that. And you can see there's plenty of space for both. So overall, I'm very impressed with these two products. I've been very impressed with all the Better Boat products I've reviewed. If you guys want to check out any of those other products, like I said, there'll be links in the description down below. To be sure to check all that stuff out, they have like some deck cleaner, some boat soap, some vinyl cleaner, um, some support poles, they got the dock lines, they got everything you need if you're into boating like we are. Be sure to check all that stuff out and I'll have a link to their, their uh, website as well. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Be sure to browse my channel and subscribe. I'm gonna have a few more videos coming out in the near future. We go fishing on Lake Ontario and I catch a king salmon, so be sure to check that out coming up here in the next few weeks. I appreciate the support as always. Take care and have a great day.